Hello everyone, Emma here and I am in Melbourne right now. <sighs> I have a queen bed. Doctor Who's on. Oh, I'm so excited. Look at David Dennis. Look at him. Look how fluffy he is. Oh. Probably everyone through the walls right now but I don't really care because I have had the best day it has been so amazing so I caught the plane and I can be your hero baby I can kiss away so much for your lovely comments about don't be nervous it's going to be fine because it was it truly was Dad took me to the airport and he waited with me until my plane came in and then I got on it and I was like this. I had some very chatty people on the plane next to me which was great because they kind of acted as parents towards me and like took me in. I feel like I'm so far away from you guys. Mm, hello. Much better. Sandwich for breakfast and then I caught a taxi straight to the school which cost me $70. That's like half the price of the first day of my course. But that's okay. Nonetheless, they got me there safely. Uh, the college was an amazing building. Like, it looked like Harvard or something out of a movie. I was the first person in there and two others joined me pretty soon after that. I realized we were in the wrong room <laughs> because I'm awkward like that. But we found the right place. After that, we went straight into exercises. So, you know, we did the breathing thing and then just letting everything be relaxed. He told us a bit about the method that we're using. And then we actually had to act. So I was partnered with a lovely girl who uh, decided with me that we would do a scene from some lines. Duh. <laughs> Um, so we chose to do, uh, we were a couple who weren't getting along very well and we had to go to someone else's wedding. And I was annoying her and, you know, really angry but trying to keep it together because she cheated on with someone else. And having to get that into my mindset was so different. It went really, really, really well. Um, everyone thought it was hilarious, which is kind of the vibe I give off even when I'm trying to be serious. The amazing teacher who is just so full of life and energy and... You know, he's got heaps of experience. He said that he really liked it and he could tell straight off the bat what I was trying to get across. And I was like, are you kidding me? I've never acted before and you know what I'm trying to tell you through actions. He gave critical feedback and so did the audience. And you know, we redid the take twice, but some people had to redo it 20 times. I think the reason we only had to do it twice more was because we ran out of time. And now I'm in my hotel, like I said, queen bed, hey, hey. Being on this journey with me, I don't feel so alone when you guys are here, which is lovely. It's nice to have friends around the world. The pressure's on! We're start. <laughs> <laughs> we both decided it looks exactly like the Doctor Who scene, where there's like that guy and they're like, praise him. Praise him! This is what happened to Joe. Oh, You'll leave it right here. Let's go. I won't okay. leave you, I promise. You have my word on it. I don't want to get into it. You know the hallway? Because when you walk in, it's pretty. And then you go on the lift and it's like... And then corridors of death. Endless corridors. Yes. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for letting me know that you're coming. Oh, to anytime. Nearby. Nearby. <laughs> Two hours away is nearby. Wow. Not across the pond. Yeah. Mm. Okay, do you want me to walk you down? Alright. Sweet. 